this was one of the number one things I wanted to do. Go to the Enchanted Christmas Market. Ben series. Tia Marie channel. Let's get it. We got out here to the Enchanted Christmas Market. I had to buy tickets in advance. Um, it's at the Hibia Park. Really, really creative. I tried to go last year. It was sold out. But I got a chance to go this year. And they really are detail-oriented when it comes to stuff like this. We were even given mugs as we walked in. The tickets were um, 1,500 yen. So that is like, depending on the dollar amount, $15 or right now is maybe like $11 to get in. They have these little shops set up and these guys were performing and so I had no idea they were gonna perform but thoroughly enjoyed it as if we was one of those little kids on the front row. Um, so the little shops had stuff you can buy like Christmas ornaments and then on one side it had shops where you can buy food and stuff to eat. Japan is like a foodie place so they love their food trucks and food shops. to the other side with the food we seen a, a Jesus display and then they had a wall of wreaths and so you can scan the QR code and actually purchase a wreath like this um, they are really into creative things and details so I was not surprised and it had to be at least 50 wreaths available they had games and this is on the way over to where the food is clearly the food side is way bigger than side where you could buy gifts at. Over here they had like um, a water fountain. It had just like foods that you'll find over in Europe. They had some Japanese foods as well and of course they sell alcohol. This is kind of like the highlight but everywhere you go in Japan the food area is always the best part. I like that we got tickets later on in the day because we got to see it with the lights turned on. And it wasn't much, but that was the Enchanted Christmas Market, something I really wanted to do. Make sure you subscribe and come back.